What's the best advice your dad or father figure, father figure ever gave you? How about Eric sharing this one? I've gotten and still get advice from my dad. One of the best advice, work smarter than harder. Uh, certainly some great advice that uh, Eric's dad shared with him. Thank you, Eric, for sharing that with us. You can continue to share them using the hashtag I am up. I want to bring on our panel now. And, uh, you know, guys, for me and my dad, Tashara, take it away. <laughs> <laughs> I would say um, I've gotten a lot of great advice. Uh, it's hard to kind of sum it up, um, but mainly he always told me to always stay true to yourself um, and never let anybody uh, put you in a situation where you have to act out of character. And he consistently reminds me of that even nowadays as an adult. What about you, Kara? Well, I was able to ask him this morning. I was like, what's the best advice you've ever given me? <laughs> and he said... Proverbs 3, trust in the Lord with all your heart, uh, lean on your own understanding and all your ways acknowledge him and he'll make your path straight. Yes, I did memorize that. See, he taught me something. Uh, Greg, I thought you'd be proud. <laughs> Yeah, that, that's good. And, and it's funny you mentioned that Bible verse. There's a picture of me and my dad uh, at my wedding. And there's a story behind that picture I'll have to share later. But uh, 2 Thessalonians 3.10, he who does not work, neither shall he eat. You know, that's, that's so if you don't work, you don't eat. And, and, right. another, funny, and another funny one, uh, when he dropped me off in college, my freshman year in college, when he was dropping me off, he, all, he also told me, um, the girls will be here when you graduate. <laughs> so, uh, okay. so that was some other advice. I'm not sure. I, I'm not so sure I followed that one. But uh, again, that, that's another story too. All right, but yeah, I, mi I miss my dad. We had some great conversations, you know, on on the back porch as an adult. We had some uh, grown man conversations. So I, I cherish those, and I would give anything to to go back to those days. All right, Mark, back to you. Thank you, Greg. Appreciate you guys giving me a moment. My dad, as you see in this picture here with Kara has been my biggest cheerleader and biggest supporter. And uh, it's not any one piece of advice. It's just that him being there and sharing unconditional love. I am grateful for that. And I hope everybody gets to experience that, whether it's from their father or anybody else special in their life. Happy Father's Day, Dad.